Hi, I'm Jaylene Kent and I'm the president of Isla Coatings and Roofing Supply and we've been here for about 20 years um, doing almost exclusively military work, but I've only been here for 10 years and I'm really excited to um, be able to participate in celebrating the 10 year anniversary for PTAC. Just coincidentally, it turns out that um, our company, I was the very first client at PTAC. It was right when I had come on island and although my company, which my brother started 20 years ago, had knew a lot about military work, I didn't. And so it was wonderful, as simple as coming out to my office and reviewing how to go through the FedBizOps website and passwords. And the most wonderful thing about PTAC is it doesn't matter how small the question or how big the question, they always have so much expertise and you can reach out by phone, by email, um, WhatsApp, now they've got a website and they um, participate in all of our important um, construction events like our small business committee through the Guam Contractors Association. And one of the things that I can never get over with PTAC, and I always say to Boris, I say, Boris, has anyone told you lately how fantastic you are? <laughs> because over all the years, it's like it doesn't matter what it is, he always knows the answer and he always will find the answer if he doesn't have the answer. Um, so they're timely, the conferences they put on that are for free, let me say it again, for free, are just um, spot on and they, they cover every relevant thing we might need to know, like how to do our capability statement, how to um, get paid through WAF, W-A-W-F, teaming agreements, joint ventures, um, you know, it's like so overwhelming when you first start get, getting involved in the military work, but of course on Guam, that's what we're all focusing on. So to have them here and the people that work there are just incredible. What I would like to say in closing is that um, one of the most um, fantastic things that happened was we were, my brother and I were working on a proposal in Ponape on doing the hospital there, which the military was going to perform, so they needed training and then they used our product. And my brother and I had about, I'm going to say 72 hours to turn that bid around. And Boris walked us through it and we got the award. And it was the first big award that we um, got while, while, when I first got involved with this business. So I'll always, I'll always have great memories of that. And I, and I always send people to PTAC too. I, you gotta go there, you, you know, do the outreach. So congratulations, 10 years, and fantastic that you're having a national PTAC day. It should be celebrated everywhere.